Hey guys, this is Ricardo and welcome to another Blog Tech Tips. So today guys, I'm going to show you how to fix an issue where your Samsung Galaxy, basically um, the screen times out and when the screen times out, your phone does not lock. Alright, so when the screen goes black, it basically does not, um, the lock that you have set does not engage. Now let me just demonstrate to show you what the, um, the problem is like. Now um, basically, as you can see here, alright, so when the device is locked, the normal behavior is for you to basically wake up the phone you're supposed to um, swipe and of course if you have a password set it should then ask for the password as you see I entered the password as soon as the screen is locked right now that's normal behavior now the issue here is um, with this issue the phone will lock right and my friend encountered this um, a friend basically borrowed, her, um, borrowed his phone and I just took it from out of his hand Hit the power button just as I'm going to show you now and of course she just basically swiped and it was unlocked in case you want to see it again so basically the phone is locked right the person took the phone swiped and there you go it does unlock just like that now in case you're wondering what's happening here and you're just discovered this on your phone and this is the Samsung Galaxy S8 it can also happen with the S7 this device was a S7 S6 S4 5, S4 or so on, it can happen with the Grand Prime, it doesn't really matter. As long as you have an Android device, this could potentially happen to you. So, in case you want to find the fix, the first thing I want to try guys is this. Um, you're going to go to um, settings, once you're in settings, and remember your settings might be a little bit different. You can also search for anything that you see here. Now you're going to go to lock screen and security, it's right there. Um, on yours it might be settings and then security. Anywhere that you'd set the password, that's where you'd actually go. It'll actually go into lock screen and security once you're in here you're going to search for something called smart lock now um, you're going to enter your password now once you enter your password you're going to look and as you see here there is something here called unbody detection it says device will stay unlocked while it's on and in his case this was on and he didn't know how it actually got enabled so in this case you can see it says here that it keeps your device unlocked while it's on just unlock once and your device stays unlocked as long as it's in motion um, like when you're holding or carrying your device your device will lock when it detects that it's been um, set down so basically this was on he didn't know it got on so let me just turn it off all right so let me just disable the feature so let me go ahead and mine is actually off and let's go back to the uh, main screen here let's see if it has fixed the issue of course if I hit swipe of course the for the password let's try again and again it asks for the password so let me just enter my password again so there you go so it's actually fixing his case so in case that didn't work for you guys I'm gonna go back to um, settings once you're in settings we're gonna go to um, smart lock again All right if that's not the one that's causing the issue make sure these are also off if you are not using them or you don't know how to use them so turn off trusted places trusted device and um, trusted voices right if that doesn't work guys I want you to um, Go back in lock screen and security or security then you're gonna look for um secure lock settings once you're on secure lock settings my ears might be different make sure that it says lock either in five seconds after it's been turned off or lock immediately for um if you're not sure to set it to immediately all right do not set longer time such as 30 minutes or 30 seconds or so on next make sure that lock instantly with power keys on it means that your phone if you hit the power key it will instantly lock so that's another settings you need to make sure that's on all right so if all of those um, did not work for you guys make sure also that um, your google assistant which is this assistant right here make sure it's off it might be listening for passwords as you hear there it's actually listening all right so in case it's listening might be the cause of the issue so you can go into um settings you can go to apps you can search for the google assistant and you can either roll back the updates or disable it then you can test to see if it has fixed the issue seeing that you can have your voice as a password and that might be the issue if you can actually go to the settings inside the assistant if you know how to actually do it then you can actually do that and actually um disable the, the feature all right so guys um the trick with the smart lock was that of course if you didn't know it was on um, let's go back quickly all right with the smart lock if you didn't know it was on and let me turn it back on here don't turn back on yours unless you know what you're doing and then of course i've turned it back on the trick was that if i had actually um set down the phone on the table after a while it would have actually um re-engaged the um lock 
But the trick is if you're on the go and you have to constantly be putting your password and you don't want that, you can actually set it and of course when you take out your phone, it would actually um, um, be um, unlocked unless you set it down or you could just manually force the lock to actually engage in this mode, right? So if you're not using the feature, I advise you turn it off, right? And it's a cool feature to use if you're always on the go and your phone is being triggered and you don't want to always put in your password, right? So otherwise, it's a good feature, but if it's on and you do not know, that's the issue. So guys, if you have any comments, please also leave um, one down below and also like and subscribe. Subscribe from Black Tech Tips. Bye until next time. Bye.